More to the San Antonio Food Bank than just taking care of those who need a meal. The nonprofit also teaches people how to prepare healthy meals for their families. And there's even more. As David Sears shows us, the food bank teaching students how to become chefs and use the skills to find a job in the culinary industry and in turn give back. I wanted to learn more about cooking. I, for a little while, did meal preps and I was like doing really good, but I wasn't sure how to cut things or how to cook things. You want to cut the two inches? And that is why Venezia Garcia enrolled in the San Antonio Food Bank's culinary training program. I want to do my own meal preps and help people eat better and like just show that fitness and eating good food can be in the same. She would like to help people through owning her own restaurant one day, but for now, Garcia is one of nine students taking the current free 18-week course under the direction of Chef Gregory Williams. They start with the basics like knife handling skills and then really start cooking. Very similar to going to school. Um, we have a day of lecture, we have days of labs, there's quizzes every week, there's cooking exams that are timed just like you see on the culinary shows and then they get graded and critiqued. Not, no yelling. It's all part of the food bank's Food for Today, Food for Tomorrow, Food for a Lifetime initiative. This program is the food for a lifetime, where if you have an actual skill set that you can translate into a job, then you can go out in the field. Learning to be a chef in here can open a lot of doors for these students. Take Dakota Prado, once a student, now an actual employee of the food bank. The course did teach me how to make uh, so many kinds of bread, so now I apply that to what I'm working with right now, but um, other skills as well. Dakota, who's 19, recently moved to Texas from Colorado. He heard about the program and decided to take advantage of the opportunity, and now he is an example of what the program is all about. Prado has a job giving back to his new community. You're doing good for your community. You're kind of giving back to your community. David Sears, KSAT 12 News.